Psalms 103, 15 and 16. As for man, his days are like grass. As a flower of the field, so he flourishes. For the wind passes over it and it is gone. And its place remembers it no more. There are many expressions in the Bible that beautifully illustrates the transitions of man's life on earth. These verses present one of the best of them. From the moment man is born, he is in a fierce struggle to acquire everything that he sees and hears. But to the question, why all this? No clear relevant answers can be given. Despite knowing that he will leave everything behind and return to the soil, the efforts continue without any break. When we say that human life is like grass, we think that it has an end that cannot be extended, no matter how hard we try. Grass has a shorter lifespan compared to many other plants and trees. Its size is also small. But the second simile, like a flower in the field, directs our imagination toward a slightly more beautiful situation. God gives us the opportunity to spread happiness around us in the short life, to be fragrant by doing good to others. The fact that a flower has a shorter lifespan than grass reminds us of the importance of its short duration. We remember with joy and gratitude the names of those who have filled fragrance in history, just as a soft and beautiful flower has to face dry, strong winds, the winds test our goodness and character. At the end of life, all of us have to face some wind, be it the infirmity of age, an attack of disease, or the cruelty of some unexpected accident. Whatever it may be, when the last bell rings to leave this life, we will enter the world that will never end. If we can achieve that greatest goal of this short life today, which is to ensure that we will live with God forever, then we have succeeded and our life has become meaningful. May God bless you.